fuck am I doing here? I felt funny about this job right off. As soon as I felt it, I should have said no thank you and walked. But I never fucking listened. It's like every time I got burned buying weed. I knew the guy wasn't right. I could feel it. But I wanted to believe him. If he wasn't lying and it was Ty Stick, then whoa, baby. But it was never Ty Stick. And I said if I ever felt that way about a job, I'd walk. And I did, but I didn't. Because of the fucking money. What's done is done. I need you cool. Are you cool? You want to smoke? Why not? And the smokes are in the car we ditched. Okay. Let's go through what happened here. We're in the place. Everything's going fine. And the alarm gets tripped. I turn around, there's all these cops outside. He will ride. It was like BAM! You know, I blink my eyes, and they're there. Everybody starts going ape shit. Mr. Blonde starts shooting the place. That's up. not correct. What's wrong with it? The cops didn't show up after your arm went off. They showed up after Blonde started shooting everybody. All I know is I hear the alarm, I see the cops. I'm telling you, it wasn't that soon. They didn't make their presence known until Mr. Blonde went off. I'm not saying they weren't there. I'm saying they were there. They just didn't make their move until Mr. Blonde started acting like a madman. And that's how I know we were set up. You can see that, can't you, Mr. White? Enough of this Mr. White shit. Whoa, whoa. Don't tell me your name. Jesus, I don't want to know. I'm not going to tell you mine. Oh, you're right. This is bad. How'd you get out? I shot my way out. Everybody's shooting, so I just blasted my way out of there. Tagged a couple of cops. You killing anybody? Just a few cops. No real people. Uh-uh. Just cops. Jeez, can you believe Mr. Blonde? It's one of the most fucking insane thing I've ever seen in my life. Who the fuck could Joe hire somebody like that? I mean, I don't want to kill anybody. But if I need to get out of that door and you're standing in my way, one way or the other, you're getting out of my way. That's the way I look at it. You know, you got a choice between doing 10 years or taking out some stupid motherfucker. There's no choice at all, you know? I ain't no madman either. What the fuck was Joe thinking? You can't hire a guy like that. Motherfucker's unstable. What do you think? You think he was panicked or was he just trigger happy or what? He's a sick fucking maniac. We're lucky we didn't get tagged when he was shooting up the place. I was this close to tagging him myself. I mean, everybody panics. When things get tense, everybody panics. Everybody. I don't care what your name is. It just happens. It's human nature. But you panic inside. You panic in your head. You take a couple of seconds to get a grip and deal with the situation. But what you don't do is shoot up the place and kill everybody. What you're supposed to do is act like a fucking professional. You know, a psychopath is not a professional. You can't work with a fucking psychopath. You don't know what these sick assholes are gonna do next. I mean, Jesus Christ, how old do you think that, that black girl was? 20, maybe, maybe 21? See what happened to anybody else? Me and Mr. Orange jumped in a car, and Mr. Brown floored it. After that, I don't know what went down. See, from that point, it's every man for himself. And as for Mr. Blonde and Mr. Blue, I'm having the foggiest. But as soon as I got out of there, I didn't look back. And what do you think? What do I think? I think the cops either caught him or killed him. You don't think there's a chance they could have punched through? You found a hole. No, and that was a fucking miracle. And even if they did get away, where are they? Don't you think it's possible that they found the diamonds and they No, no, no. How can you be so sure? Because I got the diamonds. Where? I got them, all right? What, are they in the car? Where are they? No, they're not in the car, and no, I don't have them with me. You want to go get them? Sure, we'll go right now. But you got to listen to what I'm telling you. We were fucking set up. Someone's working in leagues with the cops. We're going to chew this in our midst. And I think we need to get our heads checked for sticking around here. That was the plan. The plan was we meet here. Well, where the hell is everybody? I say the plan is null and void as soon as we find out there's a rat in the house. We haven't got the slightest idea where Mr. Blonde or Mr. Blue are. They could be in prison or dead. They could be sweating in station right now. Sure, they don't know their names, but they could be singing about this place. It, I mean, it could be happening right now. The cops could be in their cars, driving here right this minute. I swear to God, I fucking jinxed. What?
A couple of jobs back was a four-man job. Turns out one of them was an undercover cop. No shit. You know, lucky we got on it fast. We ended up having to walk away from the whole thing just to get it. So who's the rat this time? Mr. Blue? Mr. Blonde? Joe? This is Joe's show. Maybe he set it up to set it up. No, 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 I don't buy it. I, I've known Joe a long time, and I, I can straight up say for sure that Joe definitely didn't have anything to do with this bullshit. Oh, you've known Joe a long time, have you? Well, I've known Joe since I was a kid. But to say Joe definitely didn't do it is ridiculous. I mean, I know I didn't do it, because I know what I did and didn't do. But I can't definitely say that about anyone else, because I don't definitely know. For all I know, you're the rat. For all I know, you're the rat. Well, now you're using your head. For all we know, he's the rat. 